In this video, we are going to learn about inductive reasoning and deductive reasoning. First of all, what is inductive reasoning and what is deductive reasoning? To show in this simple picture, inductive reasoning is from special cases. We look for patterns and we generalize it to get a principle that applies to all the cases. Inductive reasoning is we know the general principle and we draw conclusions about each special case. So that is applying the principle on the cases. Let's look at an example of each type of reasoning. Okay. So we are doing this types of reasoning in everyday life, just we were not aware of it. I live in Frisco. I know there are many burger places, but let's say for our uh, example here, we say there are 10 places sell burger, that sell burgers in Frisco. My reasoning here is I went to all the 10 places and we tried their burgers. Each one of them is very good. So my conclusion here is all burger places are good in Frisco. I drew the conclusion from all the special cases. This is a generalization that applies to all burger places. This is inductive reasoning. Now, my friend came to town to visit and I told her all burger places are good in Frisco. Of course, she trusted me. So now when she looked for a place to eat, she was thinking, okay, I know that all burger places are good in Frisco, so I can go to any of them and eat good burgers. Her thinking was from the general principle and apply that principle to each special case. So her conclusion is each of these restaurants would give her good burgers. This reasoning process is deductive reasoning from a general conclusion to draw a conclusion on each special case. To summarize this, inductive reasoning is the process of observing data, recognizing patterns, and making a generalization. Deductive reasoning is the other way round. It is the process of using the known facts to reach further conclusions. 